What's going on guys? We just drove our five hour drive to get here. We are in Las Vegas now. We got this big venue for the Las Vegas card show. I mean, this place is huge. It's a big expo center. There's 400 tables that are gonna be here. So then tomorrow we're gonna go around, you know, talk to some people, see what they're working with in their uh, cases and tables. And that's gonna be around like eight-ish. We got, we got Ivan over here. We got we got Ivan right here, and then we got Nikki behind the camera. I'm, I'm, I'm low pro behind the camera. <laughs> but then uh, the, sh the show is 10 to 6 tomorrow, so we'll show you guys some crazy footage, like trades, deals that we do. We're we clearing people out. Yeah, we're clearing people out pretty much. <laughs> so tomorrow night, tomorrow night is trade night, so we'll show you guys some crazy deals that we're going to be doing there. Stay tuned, and uh, make sure you like and subscribe for our future videos. This one's just going to be a banger, all right? This one's going to be a banger. It's a crazy show. First time vending in a bigger show like this. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next segment. All right, guys, we just woke up. We packed everything in the car. We got Ivan over here. He's packing stuff in the car. We're getting ready to head over to the show. Let's come see what we got over here. <laughs> We've got, this is all of our product, our uh, boxes of cards, our wax. We've got um, jerseys, a bunch of stuff in there. We got shoes right there. So we're getting ready to head down to the expo. So I'll see you guys at the expo when we're setting up. Guys, we just set up our whole booth. We got three tables worth of stuff. We got a bunch of stuff back here. We got our big sign. We've got Pokemon, football wax, basketball wax down here. Look, at, on this side, we got this memorabilia. Got a bunch of jerseys, Joe Burrow helmet. Then we got all our wax, basketball, baseball, football, UFC. Then we've got Ross singles. We got $5, $2, that's football, we got basketball right here. And then these are just a bunch of like uh, base cards for people completing sets. Then we got all of our sneakers right here on the second table. And the third table is where it gets fun. These are all of our graded and raw cards as well as Ivan's, YS cards. And then here's the real nice table. I mean, just look it. This table is crazy. You got the messy rainbow up there, like you got these nice PSA 10s, dude, that Kyrie is sick. Look at this Jamar Chase up here. That, that's our Brady Genesis right there. But I mean, obviously the highlight of the table is these four cards right here. That Kyler to 20 auto variation. You got the XRC Mahomes rookie. You got the Josh Allen 2 of 5 uh, Colossal RPA. And then of course the 3 of 5 James Harden Logo Man RPA for National Treasures. So I think we're gonna be walking around right now, seeing what uh, people, what deals people got for us. Right now we're just hanging around. It opens in about 30 minutes. So when when we open, we're gonna show the people coming in, show what's going on, show the activity at our table, and yeah. So I'll see you guys when that happens. All right, we're at the Vegas Card Show, trying to find some deals. Um, mainly gonna be looking for basketball today, just cause starting to go up with the basketball market and starting to come down a little bit with football. Um, but we always buying QB rookies, whatever it is. So let's get to it. What are you at on the blue shimmer jar? 2800. 28? Yeah. Supposed, supposedly like 25 or 35. Yeah, it's, a, it's usually, I think, uh, I think rule of thumb is 35, I think. Right. Yep. Yeah, I'd say market's probably like right around that 2.6 range. Yeah. It's not necessarily one I want to wiggle too That's not one you want to really get rid of. Yeah. I mean, even if well, I offer you like. Bucks on we're about too flat. When you're looking at cards like that, it's kind of hard because Blue Shimmer, great card, definitely a market that's going to go up. But when you're getting into cards like that that don't really have too many sales, like there's no specific PSA 9 sale, right? So you're trying to figure out, you know, percentage ratio based off of like the 9.5 sales or the 10 sales, anything like that. So when you're in that like I don't know market and then you still have to pay the exact market price, that's just a little too hard for us to get into. So my boy Dynasty mode. Drop the at. Drop the at. Purple wave. What are the last sales? 25. 25? It was actually 23 bid. Was the last one. 23 bid? was like mid. What's your best cash? I got offer for 23. Good seeing you. So what I was thinking is we were seeing, uh, I was looking at the PSA 10 sales. The last PSA 10 sale was back in September for 6.8K. There have been no PSA 9 sales of this card on eBay, MySlabs, Golden, Heritage, any of those since back in July, I think. 
So it's a very low pop card, obviously, a Luca Pop 40. You can't go wrong with it. 21 is a little bit strong. I think that we're going to list it at about 3.4, 3 3.2. Um, try and get that half of the PSA 10 value right there. Um, so I think it's a good buy. We got, it in, got into it at a good price. And I mean, need it. I kind of want, see, I, I, I'm a big mosaic football fan, mosaic basketball, optic basketball, and they've got some sellers over there as well. So I want to run a deal with this, definitely. What's going on, man? Not much, how you doing? I'm doing good. Uh, how much do you have uh, all the mosaic basketball, the optic, Absolutely. and then... And the mosaic. Yep, and then some of those sellers too. Yeah, for sure. All right, if I took these two, those three, that and that, would you be able to cut me a deal? Maybe like, 500 for all? I'd probably have to hold on that for right now. All right, I got uh, you. Nice to meet yeah, you, nice Tony. To meet you too. Zach. Make sure you guys go follow him. There we go. Those were, they go for like 160, and he, yeah, and he was asking 200, and then the optic things are like at 190, and he was asking 250, I believe. And then the hangers and the mosaic blasters, those weren't that bad, but you know, I, I think in total what he asked for was like seven, maybe 700. And uh, that, that mosaic mega should not be that price. I can buy it on StockX right now for 177, shipped and taxed. So, you know, help, hopefully at the end of the weekend or at the end of the day, I can go get a, go get a deal from him because I'd like to break those products. I, th those are what we started breaking on when we started common break, so I would like to bring those back into the circulation of, of the products. It's gotta be the right Yeah, right just, just needs to be the right price. Nice products though, I'll definitely be back, I'll definitely be back. All right, so we just walked over Kaboom's cards. Make sure you go follow them, YouTube, Instagram. And look at this, look at this whole case right here. Isn't that just beautiful? Yeah, you guys have a couple, but he threw this one out. And you know that one's special. So yeah. I'm definitely gonna be trying to get this. I'll do 140, how about that? 140. I think we got like 130 in it, so I can't go low than 130. I think it's like, I, I think I got 132 in it, so. Like eight bucks. Yeah. Tell it to a guy that's gonna keep it. 140. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it? Right, man. I, need, I need it, I need it. All right, guys, so we've been at the table for like, I think two hours now. Just been selling stuff, selling slabs, selling rock cards. But we've definitely picked up some stuff. Some guy came up to us and was like, hey, do you guys want some of these cards in this box? And we're looking through. We picked out some cards that we like. So we got this Donovan Mitchell rookie right there. We've got Katie Red Wave from 2017. Got this Michael Porter Jr. rookie. That's sick. Got Lori Blue Hoops rookie. Got a Kristen Yelich rookie, Topps Chrome. We got this Clay Matthews, two of five, gold vinyl, that's sick. And this Clay Thompson, I believe this is a rookie from Select. And then uh, our biggest pickup, which is, I mean, it's sad. You, you guys already saw, but I mean, I needed to. We're here, why not, you know? Had to pick that up, but uh, yeah. Right now we're gonna go do some uh, steals and deals with Ivan again. Go see if we can demon some slabs for himself or for us. And then we got trade night tonight, so make sure you guys stay tuned. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Keep watching this video. We're just walking around trying to see if we can use this part of a trade. What's up, Robbie? How you doing, brother? Need it. I started like 2-8. Give me 32 for it. I'll do three. Get you guys, get you guys some clout. Need it, all right. So that one, we got into a little bit higher than we'd be getting into most cards at. I'd say like we're probably into that card like 85% of market, but he was right. The McDavid's are very, very hard to find autos of in general. And then even less of the people that actually have the autos want to sell them. And you know, that's game used. It's one of his, uh, letters in his name geez and it's an auto bgs 910 can't go wrong so we're taking the luca that we picked up earlier today we're trading into sga checkerboard 10 very low pop on this love sga 
Love the upside on him. OKC has 75 picks in the next four years. And then you know classic Herbie and 200 cash. Need it. Thank you, brother. Good deal. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. There you go. All right, so day one is complete, being a dealer at the Las Vegas Card Show. This is what we picked up. I think we bought someone's whole like box out. I'll be doing a recap on all of these PSA slabs, all this raw stuff that we got uh, later in the video. But Ivan still got some cards that you guys saw. So let's have him talk about these. So we still got the McDavid, right? This is, uh, we're waiting for sales on this, but gotta love it. McDavid rookie. And then we took the, um, the Luca. We did the trade, the SGA still there. And then I took the Herbert that was the Ruby wave out of 149 and traded it for the star date plus a little bit of cash on his end. I uh, love this Kobe card. This is one of the most iconic Kobe cards there is. Um, even if it's for the PC or just to flip it, absolutely need it. So yeah, now we're going to the trade night hosted by Game Day. I think it's 7 to 11. So we'll be showing you guys all the deals that we're going to be doing in there. So I'll see you guys there. Last night was trade night. It was day two. We just woke up. It's Saturday morning. Trade night. Didn't get a lot of footage. Not much big things went down we sold a bunch of slabs traded a couple nothing too crazy though but ivan did pick up something crazy so, right. so let's see what he picked up so remember that star date that we got from the herbert red wave psa 9 yeah so we took it fury auto out of 12 need it from leaf sold way too many of these for my liking and then uh well now we lost money on this deal because this is just going into my vault mason mount out of 50 psa 9 just no biggie. Need it. Scored a hat trick this morning. Doubled the price of this car. Tough. Yeah. Just doing a bulk deal for some slabbies. Some slight. Redback 9. Zion. Zion. Luca. RJ. Ja. Luca. God damn it. Minus $3 right there. Okay, cool. Me and my boy Vinny here just doing some slab deals, just picking up some good stuff. Whenever he comes by, I always get bent over on my margins, but it's okay, because we love him. Appreciate it, bro. Thanks for the deal, bud. All right, guys, so we just did a big trade with my with my brother Mike right here. He brought, he brought us this, BGS 9 Auto 10 Herbert RPA from H2. To 10 gold, there you go. And in exchange, we gave them um, what was it, three seven, three thousand seven hundred dollars, and then my beloved Tom Brady Genesis. So it's a big trade. Very excited about this card. Hopefully, he has fun with that and this right here too. He's in Vegas, so let's see what he does with it. But appreciate you, man. Thank you guys. Thank you. All right, so the show's kind of slowed down. Our booth slowed down with people coming through, so. I'm gonna go see if I can get anything for this. You guys saw that we traded for this and some cash earlier. So, you know, let's, I just wanna go see what we can get some offers for, try to trade her. What if it's something that we wanna pick up? That's sick. Oh, here it is. Zach Levine, rookie RPA to 10. You guys, uh, Doing any buying or trading? Maybe trade. All right. So he said he'd be interested in the trading, and he's got a bunch of really nice stuff over there. So I'm gonna go grab Ivan, see what we can make happen. You know. All right. Well, Herbie, we picked up earlier doing a little trade ski with the beautiful, beautiful man Henry. Always happy to help. Uh, <laughs> Lamelo Red, PSA 10 pop five and then this is a pop 16 tray pink velocity there we go perfect henry thank always you for the pleasure, deal brother. always a pleasure absolutely we just got back it's day three last night was the dealer hangout party thing that was crazy we opened personal we opened one optic hobby a select hobby and an origin hobby you guys probably saw that if you guys went on the instagram live last night but um, yeah, we're all tired now. We got home at like, I wanna say midnight, one. Um, it's day three, Sunday. We're gonna be looking for 
buying people out of their tables, out of their boxes, you know. Looking for some steals. Ivan's setting up right now. I just finished setting up about 10 minutes ago. I got red zone on because, you know, I got to watch it. See what's going on. So we didn't get to show you guys the end of the show on Sunday. It was really slow and me and Ivan kind of just went around and tried to buy some stuff, which we did, as you can see. We bought all, we bought this box and we bought this box. So we're going through these boxes right now, getting ready for Whatnot Lives. So that's pretty much what we did Sunday. We didn't really sell a lot. I mean, we sold, I think, like 10, 15, 20 slabs. Some guy just came, said, let me get that, 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 that. He, he, pl he plugged it up. But Ivan, do you want to show him what you got? Uh, some of you do, don't know, most of you don't know, I my mean, first video obviously don't know. I'm from Russia originally and uh, Ovi is my lord and savior. So you put an Ovechkin auto in front of me, I'm not, not gonna buy it. So 2013, uh, very low pop, I think under, I think pop five or something like that. 2013 Prism Ovi auto, can't go wrong for the PC. So yeah, Las Vegas card show was definitely a success. Got to meet a bunch of different people, a bunch of really cool guys. Got to meet some people who knew who we were, watch the breaks, watch the whatnots. But yeah, so now we're just setting up for the whatnots for the week. And Thank you yeah. for everyone that came yeah. out and said what's up to us. Yeah, appreciate Thank anyone that did deals with us. But make sure you guys like and subscribe. Make sure you put the bell notification on for the next video. Next video that we're going to be dropping is going to be a banger. I don't know what it is. But it will be a banger, so make sure you guys watch that. Make sure you guys follow us on Instagram, at Convrex, and on whatnot, at Convrex. And yeah, I haven't got anything to say. Like, like and subscribe for the YouTube album. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. One more time. Like and subscribe. There we go.